YouTube, what is up? It's AD with US Squads. I hope you're enjoying your day. It's a five minute video or less. I'm gonna show you guys how to switch out the floor plate of your Glock Safe Action Pistol Magazine. These are the polymer magazines that you're probably very familiar with if you're watching this video. A question you may have is why would you switch out this magazine floor plate? Well, a couple reasons. One, after uh, some time, your Glock magazine floor plate was gonna get pretty abused if you're properly uh, doing magazine changes because once this is uh, empty, you should be dropping this magazine and it most likely will hit the ground, concrete, asphalt, dirt, rocks, etc., gravel. Uh, and these get really beat up after some time. So you might wanna just, you know, for $3.50, you wanna change these out with a new one and get that looking perfect again. And that's just, you know, something you may want to do. Also, there's customized aluminum versions of these floor plates with cool laser engraved icons such as, you know, military designations, cool sayings, biohazard stuff, zombie killer stuff. So, you know, they have these cool plates and those are like $20 a piece, which is kind of an expensive customization in my opinion. But, you know, you know, to each his own, you might find that pretty interesting. And then for me, um, uh, two reasons, I do sometimes filter these out and change out some fresh floor plates after they get really grody. But I also use these colored ones. Uh, a gentleman gave me the idea quite some time ago at a shooting match. He had these blue floor plates on and uh, you know it distinguished his magazines from everybody else on his squad. So a lot of, a lot of uh, the shooting matches there's uh, quite a high percentage of shooters that are using Glock pistols and our magazines all look the same. So this actually distinguishes and clears that confusion up. Some people write big letters on their magazines with silver markers, etc. And that's cool, uh, white markers. But um, I don't really like to do that to all my magazines. I just want to change out the floor plate. So for $3.50, easy solution. So let me show you how it's done. Right here we have a empty magazine. This is a Glock magazine, Glock 17, 17 round standard capacity magazine. I'm gonna take my Glock tool. You don't need a Glock tool, you just need a punch tool that has a little bit of leverage on it. And I'm gonna show you, see this little push button here? You're gonna push that down and you're gonna push it down until it makes a clicking noise. Okay, once it makes that clicking noise, you're gonna actually squeeze the magazine body squeeze because there's little ears right here underneath that kind of latch those together and you're going to simply pull and lever lever give this some leverage and that will loosen up the magazine floor plate you're just going to slide it forward toward the front of the magazine with your thumb you're just going to hold that spring down so it doesn't fly up at your face just in case and then that's off now the floor plate that little locking floor plate is snapped in here kind of sideways you're actually going to just pull that out because you need that back and there's that little locking floor plate dilly dally. So I'm going to put this back on with the nipple kind of facing you. And this uh, tapered end is going to be toward the front of the magazine. So as you can see, I just put that back in there so it just slides in there using my thumb to depress that floor plate locking plate in. I'm going to grab my replacement floor plate and I'm going to slide this in uh, starting from the front toward the rear and I'm going to have this round button near the front of the magazine and I'm just going to simply push this forward. Once I get it there I'm going to push these ears in and kind of use some force and it's going to snap in in like a second. That's it. Now that nipple is actually off a little bit. I can fix that. And that's it. Now that nipple is completely flush with this floor plate. It's locked in there. It's on. The ears are perfectly aligned and that's it. That's how you replace that floor plate in less than a minute. Any questions, please shoot me a message down below. I definitely appreciate you guys watching. Thumbs up if this video was helpful. And you guys have a great day. Thank you.